Hey guys, it's me, Kosia, the world's leading female pickup coach. Now, I wanted to answer a question I get asked quite a lot um, by both men and women. They often ask me, why is there such a demand now um, for pickup coaches and videos about attracting women and books and courses and so on, when 20 years ago, men just seemed to get on with it. They didn't have any of this advice and men did very well um, 20, 30, 40 years ago. Um, and I had a, an idea in my head, but I thought, mm, let me just do some research before I answer it. Did my research, thought about it, spoke to some people about it, and of course my rough idea that I had at the beginning was absolutely right. This is the answer. Now, in the last, I would say 50 years, there has been a huge revolution. Um, women are now more successful than ever, we have more power, whether it's sexually, at home, um, in the workplace, um, but especially in the media, we have a lot, a lot of power now. And obviously, um, from a woman's point of view, that is fantastic, and I am so, so happy about that. Um, and it's about time women started um, calling the shots, I would say. But of course, with everything, there's a downside, and the downside here is that men are actually more confused than ever um, about women. Suddenly they're told that they shouldn't be acting alpha, that they should be acting like wimps, that they should be acting like big girls' blouses, um, that they should uh, respect a woman, that they shouldn't respect a woman. They're being told all this different stuff in the media and it's left them completely confused. Um, and not only that, but the female role models are getting stronger and stronger and stronger. You know, like we've got Madonna, we've got um, world female leaders, um, you know, England had one of the toughest, toughest, um, strongest alpha leaders and it was a woman. In terms of uh, celebrity culture, I mean, it's, it's, it's absolutely huge. The women are becoming so alpha, so strong, um, and like I said, that's great, but on the flip side, if you look at the men's role models, they're becoming more and more weaker, becoming so much more beta. Um, I don't want to say any names now. Um, I'll put a few pictures at the end and you can, can make up your mind who they are. The men 20, 30, 40 years ago, their role models were, um, for lack of a better word, men. You had Oliver Reed, Richard Burton, Richard Harris, uh, Cary Grant, um, Winston Churchill, I mean the leaders then were, were men, they were really strong men. I mean now if you look at some of the, the politicians that we have and some of the leaders, I mean they're, you know, I, I know women much more balls than, than they will ever have. Um, it's quite pathetic really. There used to be um, Clark, you know, Clark Gable, Frank Sinatra, these were all alpha, strong men. Uh, Sean Connery, you know, even the James Bond now are getting, even now the James Bond characters are getting more and more effeminate, you could say, um, less alpha. So this is the big problem here, so there's been a complete shift. And not only that, but unfortunately, uh, the role models for men also, you've got this, these two extremes now, you've got either very beta um, men that, that women openly laugh at and, and bully, or you've got the extreme other case, which is uh, yobs and, and gangster rappers and, and all this. This is like extreme kind of violent alpha. And there's nothing in between. And there's no more real men left for these guys to look up to. I mean, there's one or two, but, but it's far and few between. So like I said, this is, this is a huge reason, I think, why guys now um, have to actually pay and come on courses such as PUA training and, and buy books to be told for sure that they have to act like a man. I know that's not very popular to say that, but a man must be a man in certain situations, and sometimes they need to hear a woman like me say that to them. So I um, just had to get that out in the open, guys, okay? If you have any more questions, feel free to ask me on either my MySpace page or my Facebook. And don't forget to buy the book. Maybe make chemistry in the 15 steps. Thanks guys.